Show me in your business where you can invest and get a 50X or 100X. It's typically only through human beings. It's referral sources. Most companies, even large companies, there's less than 100 relationships that make or break a company. Mentors, advisors, investors, centers of influence, referral sources. It's great to have 10 million followers, but oftentimes it's a handful of people. And when you show up for those relationships with a personalized experience, it's amazing how people flock and flourish. You know, people are like, John, why don't you just give them a gift card? So here's a piece of plastic, go buy your own gift. How many of you have received a gift card in last year? How does it make you feel? Most of the time it makes people feel like they don't matter. Like, hey, you weren't worth the time to go select something, choose something, do something. Like if I give my wife, hey, here's a gift card, go buy your own stuff. She's like pissed. Why? Because I didn't put the energy and effort to personalize it to her. We don't realize that what we're communicating to relationships when we do those sorts of things, the personalization changes everything. Why we don't allow when we're, people are hiring us, people are like, John, I want to send this out. Can you put my logo on it? I'm like, nope, it came to the wrong agency. We won't do logos. I'm like, what are you talking about? I said, is this a relationship or a transaction? When you put a logo on something, you take it from being a personal one-to-one -one relationship to being trying to manipulate and turn that person into a billboard. People do things in the business world they'd never do personally. Imagine if you get invited to your best friend's wedding, you go to the wedding, beautiful Tiffany's vase. Did you put compliments of Chris on the Tiffany's vase or compliments of XYZ law firm or compliments of giftology? It'd be the tackiest thing in the world. But we do that in business and we call it gifting and marketing and branding.